if you think Samsung was done after One UI 7, you might want to think again. Because today, we're diving into something really exciting. The first leaks and hands-on footage of Samsung's next big software upgrade, One UI 8, based on Android 16. And trust me, from what we're seeing, it's not just a small update. It's shaping up to be a real step forward in how Samsung devices will look and feel. So grab your coffee or your snack because we've got a lot to talk about. First up, one of the biggest things catching everyone's eye is the new blur aesthetics. And no, it's not just some random visual tweak. Samsung is completely changing how dialog boxes look. Instead of the usual solid backgrounds that just switch between light and dark modes, One UI 8 is introducing a high density blur effect. Imagine opening a settings pop-up, and instead of a boring gray or black box, you get this beautifully blurred background that blends into whatever's behind it. It looks modern, it looks clean, and honestly, it gives the interface this premium feel that you usually expect from luxury tech. It's a subtle touch, but it's one of those things you'll notice immediately, and you'll love it. Now, moving on to Quick Share, Samsung's popular file sharing feature. After merging with Google's nearby Share, Quick Share has become one of the must-have tools for Android users. And in One UI 8, it's getting a complete redesign too. Quick Share will now have separate send and receive tabs, making it way easier to share files between devices. No more digging into settings or toggling visibility options just to send a photo to your friend. It's small changes like this that really make a difference in day-to-day -day use. We also have changes coming to Samsung's stock apps. Apps like Gallery and My Files are getting fresh designs. New shapes like circles and tiles are replacing the old boring rectangular blocks. It's all about making things look cleaner, sharper, and just more pleasant to navigate. Samsung isn't overhauling everything overnight, but it's clear they're putting a lot of attention into making One UI feel more polished, more alive. And here's something even bigger. Samsung is not keeping all the new AI features locked to their latest phones anymore. While One UI 7 kept features like Now Brief exclusive to the Galaxy S25 series, One UI 8 is opening things up a bit more. It's starting to bring that experience to other models too. And that's a huge deal if you're using slightly older Samsung devices. It means you won't feel left out just because you didn't buy the absolute newest phone this year. Now, all these changes are rumored to officially debut with the Galaxy Z Flip 7 and Z Fold 7 possibly during Samsung's Unpacked event, which could happen as early as July. That's not too far away. And honestly, seeing the way Samsung is layering these design upgrades, the foldables are going to look even better than ever with One UI 8 right out of the box. But let me give you my honest opinion. This feels like a mature Samsung. Instead of trying to throw a hundred flashy features at us, they're focusing on the details, on polishing what's already there. One UI 8 doesn't look like a revolution at first glance, but when you add up the beautiful blur effects, the cleaner stock apps, the smarter quick share, and the wider AI access, it paints a picture of a company that's refining its ecosystem for the long term. And honestly, that's what makes an operating system truly enjoyable to use day after day. So if this is the future of Samsung's One UI, I'm seriously excited. And if they manage to pull it off, just like the leaks are showing, One UI 8 could be one of the most satisfying Android experiences yet. Let's see what Samsung officially unveils. But right now, things are looking very, very good. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed our video. If you haven't already, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel. By subscribing, you'll stay updated with our latest videos covering tech trends, gadgets,